Sometimes you might anomaly. Call upon these persons here present that I, Jaden Adrian Salmon, do have you, Sashana Renee McDonald, to be my lawful wedded wife, to live together after God's holy ordinance in holy matrimony. Will you love her? Will you cherish her? Will you honor her in sickness and in health, in prosperity and adversity, forsaking all others, keeping yourself only unto her so long as you both shall live? I do. When the sky is falling, I promise you I'm all in, no turning back. And every day, Every moment, every breath you take I choose you I call upon these persons in present that I Sashano, Renee, McDonald Do have you Jadon, Adrian, Thamon To be my lawful wedded husband to live together in the sacred estate of matrimony. Will you love him? Will you honor him? Will you cherish him in sickness and in health, in prosperity as well as adversity, forsaking all others, keeping yourself only unto him so long as you both shall live? Is this your solemn declaration, Madam Sashan? I absolutely do. <laughs> In plaiting these three strands together, Jadon and Sashana have demonstrated that their marriage is more than a joining of two lives together. I honestly wasn't great at writing my speech, which is why I'm speaking from my heart right now. I googled, honestly, how to write a best man speech. And uh, what came up is that really I have to roast the best man. I have to say the worst things about him possible that won't get too bad, right? But I hate to disappoint him. Jadon has been an amazing friend. There is absolutely nothing that I could find negative to say about him. Honestly. It still feels just like yesterday, a Sunday I recall, at the ages six and eight when Sashana walked into my life. It was a whole new world for me. The journey of sisterhood became for two little girls as we created a bond that at some point or the other, you have all been able to witness. Sash, what I love about our journey is that it was never a competition. She loves school, I didn't. She likes Milo, I'm a Horlicks girl. One was mommy's girl, the other was daddy's big baby. One he had to watch so closely, you would never guess who. I choose you.